Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Chemistry and of course uh, we're going to continue our study of benzene alright and today specifically we're going to look at the preparation of benzene preparation we're going to look at a number of methods for preparing benzene of benzene okay and do not forget that this tutorial is brought to you by the one and only O3 Schools Jam CBT Practice App. It is all you need to succeed in your exam. If you want to succeed and not succeed, go to Play Store immediately and download the application. Activate it and start practicing your way to success. You can look at our testimonies from previous years. We are not yet to play. If you want to get above 300, it is very, very possible. Start now. All right, and stop wasting your time. Let us see a question from the app. Uh, this is a 2022 question number 34. It says, benzene is obtained from the, it's been displayed on your screen right now. Benzene is displayed, uh, sorry, it's obtained rather from the A, destructive distillation of ethene. B, destructive distillation of tin. C, destructive distillation uh, of copper. And D, destructive distillation of coal. Okay, so at the end of the class, you'll be able to answer this question and many more questions that are to that has to do with our preparation of what of benzene. That is why you need this application because it has wonderful features. Like it has all the past questions, so you do not need to worry about going to bypass question anywhere. Okay, why small? There's what lecture notes structured according to the jam syllabus. Some of you read without and study without the jam syllabus. I love you in pidgin English. Okay, so you must study with the syllabus. The app has that lecture notes, so no need to worry about textbook at all. What is more again? Question search. As after you have finished what at studying benzene, you can go to the question search feature and search for benzene. Question that jam has set on that benzene chemistry will come out for you to answer. Once you have answered them, is there anything you should be scared of again? And of course, there's what a UTME mock challenge that will conduct for all students are writing jam for this particular year, every Saturday, every Saturday you must face a mock exam. And then at the end of the mock exam, I want to watch, see your result release every Saturday. So answering questions, answering likely exam questions and what past questions from the world, from, the, from that mock challenge, what to help strengthen you and fortify your preparation. So please do not play on this app. Activation is just for a little fee. At the end of the class, I'm going to answer this question. Let us go to preparation of benzene. I'll not tell you more about the app. Make hay while the sun shines. Preparation of benzene. Okay, so benzene can be prepared with a number of methods. Um, the one of the foremost methods we're going to look at is the destructive distillation of coal. I think the question we're looking at initially has been answered. Okay, so number one, destructive, destructive distillation of coal. Okay, so destructive distillation of coal followed closely by fractional distillation of coal tar and the polymerization of ethane in the presence of an organonickel catalyst, okay, gives us what benzene, okay, and um, please take note that what, it's not only benzene that is the product that is what produced, that is what gotten from this what, destructive distillation of coal, fractional distillation of what, of coal tar, okay, so there are some other products that are produced, uh, uh, like for example, we can produce, or we get phenol, apart from benzene, apart from benzene, Okay, we get phenol. We also get what um, anthracene. We get anthracene, anthracene. Okay, we also have uh, naphthalene, naphthalene, and what and other. So other products are what I also were got it from this what destructive distillation of coal. All right, phenol, anthracene, naphthalene, even toluene. Okay, you can also get it from what from this destructive distillation of coal. So, but benzene is one of the primary what uh, product that we get. Okay, from the destructive distillation of what of coal. So you will not be too wrong if you, if you, if, you are, if they ask you uh, that uh, which of the following is the product, uh, which of the following product can be gotten from the destructive distillation of coal. All right, and you not see benzene there. You not say ah, my study is totally, it's only benzene. No, be only benzene. No. Okay, we have phenol, we have anthracene, we have naphthalene, we have toluene, and the likes of them. So please take note of that. So this one of the first method of preparing benzene, destructive distillation of coal, followed closely by fractional, fractional distillation of coal tar and coal tar, coal tar, coal tar, and of course the polymerization, polymerization of ethane. All right, so please take note of all this. 
So now then, uh, uh, let's just see another method that you can use to produce what, uh, prepare what, benzene. This one I'll call it trimerization of ethane. Okay, trimerization of ethane. In this method, we use three molecules of ethane, okay, to produce what, benzene. Okay, let us see. Trimerization of ethane. Okay, so three molecules of ethane, and then we use them to produce what, benzene. Number two, second method for what, for preparing what, benzene, number two, is trimerization of ethane, of ethane. Okay, so how do we do this? Like we said, we use what, three molecules of ethane to produce what, benzene. Okay, so this is the reaction. So we have three molecules of what, of ethane. All right, um, of C, H, C, okay, C, H. This is what it time, all right? Or you can say C, 2, H, 2, three molecules. Okay, so either you put this or you put this. Okay, so these three molecules of it time, all right, then, of course, you pass it through red hot tube, okay? Red hot, either ion or copper tube. Okay, you pass this through red hot iron or copper tube, and then you are going to have what? Your benzene. All right, so this is another method of what? Of producing or preparing what benzene. So when you see red hot in chemistry, it means that the temperature is very, very high. Okay, and of course, this kind of reactions follow what I want to call free radical mechanism. But I think it's beyond the scope of this class. Maybe we may still talk about it, but uh, it's beyond the scope of this class. So just know this, that this is the method that we can use to, what, to prepare what? To prepare benzene. Trimerization of a time. Three molecules of a time, then to give us what? Benzene. So, yeah, the same thing here. If I using C2H2, this will be what now? C6H6 here. All right, so you see also pass it through red, hot, iron, or copper tube. All right, so please take note of what of that. Then let us see another method. This is sorry, the second method for, for preparing ethane. Another method for preparing, uh, sorry, not ethane, for preparing benzene. Please do not, do not mistake it. All right, so please do not forget to also like this video. Liking this video will make other students easily find these videos and learn with us. All right, subscribing is for your own good because whenever I release a new episode, you'll be there, you'll be notified that you have just published a new episode and you can quickly join us and learn. Then do not forget to share. Keep sharing. Do not be stingy. Share to your Facebook, share to your WhatsApp, share to your, to your status. Stop. Keep sharing everywhere. Let everybody come and learn oh, and come and pass. All right, those 300 scores that we had, so many of them that we had last year, all right, you can do one of them, and your friends and your loved ones can do one of them. So number three, the third method of preparing what uh, benzene is by reacting phenol with zinc dust. Okay, reacting what phenol? Reaction. Okay, let me just say reaction between phenol and zinc dust. All right, so I think this one is very easy. All right, you know what phenol is? It's a benzene ring that has what an OH group attached. So when uh, phenol reacts to with zinc dust, okay, what it gives to us is what is a benzene. Okay, so let us see that reaction. This is phenol. All right, this is what OH. Okay, then reacting itself what with zinc dust. All right, this will give us what now a benzene ring itself. All right, then plus what? Zinc or zinc. Please take note of what of this. So this is for the simple reaction between what phenol and zinc does to give us what? Benzene. Then also, we also have one of uh, the last metal I'm going to consider. That is um, uh, decarboxylation. Okay, decarboxylation is the fourth method I'm going to what consider. Decarboxylation. For decarboxylation. From the word decarboxylation means we are removing what? Carboxylic acid group, okay, to not give us what the benzene ring. So what we did, this reaction is very easy to remember. What we only do is what we find an acid, okay, that contains a benzene ring. All right, like for example, benzoic acid. You know what benzoic acid is, right? So a benzene ring that has what a carboxylic acid group attached is called a benzoic acid. So what we only look for is what is an acid, okay? It's an acid that contains a benzene ring, like benzoic acid, all right, and its salts. And then of course we what React it with what? With soda lime. Soda lime is sodium hydroxide. That is NaOH. And what? And calcium oxide. This is called soda lime. Okay, so once we react this, okay, with that, it will remove the carboxylic acid group. 
All right, from what? From the salt. Okay, sorry to move the carboxylic, but uh, acid was salt. Okay, and then what we're now going to have what our benzene ring. So let us see. Let us see that reaction. The carboxylation. The carboxylation. So what we have here, I'm going to have what our benzene ring. Okay, our uh, benzoic acid, all right, that now has what a carboxylic acid group, all right? So put this here, then here it was, will be salt, will, this, will be the salt of the carboxylic acid, like C O O N A, for example, all right? Then we react this with what? With soda lime, that is what? N A O H, then plus what? C A O. This is called soda lime. All right, so if we react this, it will remove this what salt, okay, from what from the ring, and you are going to have what a benzene ring, simple as A B C. All right, so please, these are the four methods that, of course, uh, we we'll just put our hands on, okay. We will, the, the the class could have been more than this, all right, but of course, so that we we'll shorten it and uh, make it uh, available or be, uh, 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 just make it what to be uh, at, at the scope of this court class so that no we don't all go beyond. If you go to the university, you are going to study all these things again. So please, uh, just for your class, for your for jam sake, for jam and white sake, this is very, very okay. All right, so please let us go on. Let us go to the O3 school jam app now. We answer question and then we are done with this class. Let us see. Uh, 2022, number 34, has uh, been displayed on your screen right now. It says benzene is obtained from the A. Of course, obviously, option is what? Answer is what? Option D, destructive distillation of coal. We talked about that. Then 2014, number 42. 2014, number 42. All right. They said, uh, ethane is passed through a hot tube containing organonic catalyst to produce what? What will it produce? Of course, it's benzene, all right? So that's, of course, the trimerization of what of ethane, all right? Where ethane is used to what to produce benzene by passing it through what? A red hot ion or copper tube, all right? So ethane is passed through a hot tube containing organonic catalyst to produce what? The answer very well is what? It's option C, which is what? Benzene. Okay, so these are many more questions on the old school jam CBT practice app. Go to the app, download it, and what activate it and start practicing your way to success. All right, I'll see you in the next class where we'll talk about the reactions that benzene undergoes. Very interesting reaction. See you there.